so now we will discuss uh, you have been offered a job offer by keeping your very laborious efforts and proper <coughs> preparing for the job selfless nights you have kept to crack the interviews that finally you have succeeded succeeded and got a job offer but due to some reasons you want to deny the job offer you don't you want to reject the job offer so before denying before leaving the job offer please consider this first so let us discuss this post is uh, published in economic times by sella thomas sella stella thomas head of the talent acquisition tally solutions a leading business software provider so we need to understand that which are involved in such a taking such a complicated decision why you have taken such a decision once you have cracked that uh, interviews you have kept so many sleepless nights and you have studied a lot you have solved so many questions and finally you have gotten you have gotten a chance okay now you want to you want to reject that offer so why so what are the implications and what are the consequences we need to understand this okay so first of all there are two sides for this okay one is that so whenever you have rejected the offer now uh, at the last moment of uh, last moment of joining companies need to face a huge challenge if people do not join especially what at last moment they need to start the hiring process again so stella thomas stated that it is unprofessional we have you have put your labor efforts to crack that uh, exam and you have gotten a job offer and uh, now at last moment you want to uh, you want to you want to deny you want to no, you are not ready to accept this you want to reject that job so it is unprofessional to decline an offer after once you have accepted it now now what happened it can affect the candidate's personal brand to some extent okay furthermore the organization concerned may not have a positive orientation towards such candidates when they reply letter to the company so in further if you want to consult uh, the company again if you want to be part of that company the company will not concern so your uh, application otherwise your request okay so that will that will be the one problem uh, she says she has witnessed multiple in instances of candidates declining already accepted offer she has faced so many such type of incidents in which candidates so many candidates have declined once they have accepted the offer this is called this type of attitude is called renaise renaise means one type of uh, revolution otherwise uh, we can say that uh, declining of an offer okay so see, recently she has uh, she has shared that recently they have experienced experienced in a similar situation in which uh, in which what happened candidates declined the offer on the day of joining so okay he was waiting and at the time of day of joining he has uh, declined the offer so that moment they have no any the recruiters and they have no any previous experiences and they are not prepared okay to talent acquisition team to deal with such situations so so at that last moment if any candidate has declined the offer they have many previous experiences to handle this type of situations okay that the talent team 
what about the talent acquisition team hiring team they have no any uh, previous experiences to handle this type of situations so while talking about the difficulties faced by the employers during the interview how how they have faced lot of uh, troubles they have faced while taking the interviews so you understand that this is the situation that whenever in such a situation so she uh, revealed that they never encourage such type of behavior in an organization okay so they need to give strong feedback to kind candidates it means whomever the taking the interviews hiring the candidates they need to give strong feedback to candidates who um, follow this type of attitude at last moment okay so now let us look at the situation from the candidates perspective there could be circumstances why uh, the candidate has taken such type of uh, decision which is unavoidable for him from the candidate's point of view why he has taken such a decision according to uh, 2023 job seeker report approximately 1 in 4 job seekers they have declined an offer accepting okay they have declined an offer okay why what drives this what happened why they they are taking such type of decision one is that so whenever they are, they have multiple offers in hand they normally they have a tendency they will compare with the salary and, and whatever they will compare and so they will uh, they will go for huge salary okay so that moment they need to consider company's product line is what and market value culture work environment preference of location especially in case of relocation interest in remote work opportunities you need to consider this not to consider the remuneration okay you need to you need to consider monetary benefits which are uh, related with they are the common part monetary benefits huh? will leave it that thomas offers a quick guide for individuals to help them carefully deal with this such a time you need to consider all this reflect and reevaluate reevaluate you need to you need to determine that why you want to decline the offer okay is there any proper valid reason to decline the offer be prompt and honest inform the employer as soon as the decision you have taken and don't wait for until the last moment okay apologize and express regret never avoid a difficult conversation it is best to clearly state facts okay personalize the communication it is advisable to decline the offer through a phone call or in person to show sincerity and respect however if necessary you can follow through email next express gratitude it is important to express gratitude and maintain a professional approach while acknowledging the employer's decision to hire you keep the door open if an individual has a genuine interest in working with the company in the future so you appreciate being considered for any future opportunities this helps to maintain a positive relationship and leaves the possibility open for your future collaboration okay follow up with a thank you note okay are there any legal implications that individuals should be aware of in india there is no any legal implications over this but in foreign countries they have they they can go to court okay against the candidate but india there is no any such type of legal implications of now in india okay so you you try to be aware of this type of situation and don't wait for the last date to renew an offer okay as soon as possible please inform the 